Sam. And he's Spike. Welcome to our website, where we make grammar videos that are out of this world. We got a new game, and the instructions are really hard to understand. We'll look up the words we don't know and teach you how to use a dictionary while we do. First, the instructions say, Welcome to the stupendous world of Magic Town. I'm not sure what this word stupendous means, so we need to look it up. I don't have my phone on me, but that's okay. We can use a paper dictionary. Uh -uh. A dictionary is a word book. Dictionaries list nearly all of the words in a language and give the meaning of each word, tell us how to say it, and even include information like where the word may have come from. The words in a dictionary are listed in alphabetical order, starting with A, then B, then C, and so on. There's a section of the dictionary for all of the words that begin with each letter. Stupendous starts with S, so we need to check the S section. Hmm, there are a lot of words that start with S. These words at the top of each page are called guide words. Sometimes they're at the bottom too. They show the first and last word that are on the page. So we're looking for guide words that stupendous would fall between. This page contains all the words that fall between soup and space. Stupendous won't be here because it starts with ST. T comes after P in the alphabet, so ST doesn't fall between SO and SP. It'll be on this page because ST falls between SP and SU. Here it is, stupendous. Right after the word is how to say or pronounce it. Stu, pen, dus. Next comes the part of speech. Stupendous is an adjective or a word that describes a noun. And here's the definition. Amazing or marvelous. So stupendous means amazing. Welcome to the amazing world of Magic Town. That's so much easier to understand. Let's keep reading. Each contender must first pick a character. Contender? What's that? We can use guide words to find it in the dictionary quickly. Here are the guide words for three pages contender might be on. Remember that guide words show the first and last word on a page. So which guide words does contender fall between alphabetically? Where is contender? Contender will be on page 26 because CO comes after CL and before CR in the alphabet. Here's the entry. Contender is pronounced contender. It's a noun, and there's even a picture with the definition. According to the dictionary, a contender is a player competing to win. Let's use it in a sentence. Since contender is a noun, we should make it a person, place, or thing. Which sentence uses contender correctly? Spike was a contender in the cooking contest. Contender is a noun that means a player competing to win. And Spike would try to win a cooking contest. So in this sentence from the instructions, you and I, the contenders or players in the game, have to pick characters. Okay, it looks like every character has a special power. The viridescent character can move two spaces instead of one. I wonder what viridescent means. Where is viridescent? Viridescent is on page 85 because VI comes after VE and before VO in the alphabet. Here it is. Which sentence uses viridescent correctly? We watered mom's garden full of viridescent plants. Viridescent means slightly green in color. And plants are slightly green, especially when they need a bit more water. So this sentence in the game directions means that the green character can move two spaces instead of one. You're viridescent in real life, so you want a different character? Okay. The red character can telepathize. Whoa, telepathize is a big word. Where is telepathize? 
Telepathize will be on page 78 because T-E comes after T-A and before T-H in the alphabet. Here's the entry. Which sentence uses telepathize correctly? I can't telepathize or read minds, so you have to tell me what you want. So the red character can read minds. Today, we learned how to find words in dictionaries using guide words and how to use the dictionary entries to better understand words we don't know. There's still a lot to understand in these instructions, though. We just need to persevere, and you're sure we'll have a convivial time? <laughs> hey, have you been looking up words without me? <laughs> Thanks for checking in with Sam and Spike. Like always, she's got the cam and he dropped the mic.